How's it going guys? Today I'm at Target, a different Target from last week's toy hunt, looking at some clearance items. They still have Num Nums, LOL Surprise Pets. That's super cool. Ooh, and then up here they have some of the Series 5. Okay, so these are some of the packs I was looking for. How cute is that? These are the Jelly Rolls. Oh my goodness. And then they have the Croissant Pack. How cute is that? Oh wow. So there's four total the ice cream and then the marshmallow squares but I really like the jelly roll jelly roll my bad and croissant pack those are adorable cute I can't believe series 5 is out which I guess makes sense they're clearancing out a lot of the series 4 stuff super cute I love the dessert theme the croissants are fun let's see and then down here they have more of the clearance packs from series 4.2, the nail polish play sets on clearance as well. And then they actually have some Easter Hatchimals. <laughs> I'm not sure, but that is really cool. I guess you get some special painted pastel glittery figures and it comes in this adorable little basket. Cute. Ooh, even some of the happy places have gone on clearance. That's neat. And they have a bunch of Season 2 Hatchimals. And the hot dog stands is on clearance. I have a ton of Hatchimal stuff. Oh, even a couple Little Littlest Pet Shop things are on clearance. And then Target also has some more Fingerlings. They have a bunch of different colors. I'm realizing now that there's there's a bunch of different waves of, of fingerlings and different colors. And then down here, they actually have the playset, which comes with that little guy, which he's probably exclusive to the playset. I think that's cute that it's a little jungle gym and swing and stuff. <laughs> a little playground for your fingerlings. That is awesome. They also have some big Hatchimals. I don't see the sloth or the unicorn though. I'm not sure if those are exclusives. And then a bunch of little live pets. They also have a lot of the glitter series surprise uh, lol as well as the more of the pets. They're just kind of randomly scattered. There's no boxes but that's okay. Um, have some squishies. Very cute. And then it looks like they have just a ton of LOL stuff. So they have these fizzies, which I'm not sure if they're on clearance. And then the um, three packs, as well as more of the Series 3 Little Sisters. I don't see like those new confetti ones out yet. But that's cool. Oh, and down here they have some of the new Surprisimals. These are the smaller uh, ones. There's a really cute little honeybee <laughs> that I would love to get, but that those are awesome lots of new stuff even though still after Christmas they're pretty well stocked and then down the sort of action figure aisle they have more of the grocery gang packs um, mad balls some minecraft let's see oh and down here the little um, army men are on clearance too Oh, here's a grocery gang trash can. The price is backwards. That's cool. I never um, bought that guy. So, Little Green Men as well as Roblox. <clears throat> Excuse me. It looks like just the Series 1 Roblox are on clearance. But still, that's, that's pretty cool. Got some Five Nights at Freddy's. Fun Time Freddy there. I've never opened these, but some of them look cute. <laughs> that guy's yelling at you. <laughs> and they're half off, so that's that's pretty good. Then we have some Pokemon. That Minecraft uh, playset's on sale, too. Ooh, and up here, World of Nintendo really is on clearance. <gasps> that's the Breath of the Wild Link. He's, like, really new, too. That is awesome. And he's half price. 
Sweet. So I've noticed that, again, different targets have different items um, and things on clearance and even different clearance prices. So you definitely got to hunt around and, and check things out. So now I'm at Walmart and oh my goodness, they have the sloth fingerling and he looks really cute in person. Oh man. Okay. So I'm going to have to look through these because they might have different color ones. So they have this purple with the pink hair. Also looking cute. Her name's Margo. It looks like there's just two slots. I do like the brown one. Oh, he's really cute. They have a ton of fingerlings. Wow. They even have pick me pops, which I don't think I've ever seen these at Walmart. Oh, there's that dog. <laughs> so that's awesome. They have a bunch of the single packs of pick me pops. That's super cool. They have Hatchimals, the new series or season two. So Walmart has definitely uh, recovered from after Christmas as well. That's cool. Oops, I gotta hang that back up. <laughs> Cute. But I'm really excited about those, those little fingerlings. I might have to pick one up. And then in this section, they have a lot of trolls. And then here's a look at the LOL surprise. They have some older ones. Like, isn't this like series one? Like, I remember those old older balls. And then they have... I think the first wave, or is that the second wave? I'm not sure. But some older stuff <laughs> for LOL. My Little Pony movie blind bags. Still haven't seen that movie, which I really want to. I think it's out on DVD now. Ooh, and they have some of the new soft and slow jumbo squishies. They have this hot dog. Huh. It does feel a little squishier than the older soft and slow ones. They have some fries. They're still pretty um, dense squishies, though. We have some popcorn. Is this popcorn? Popcorn with candy in it. So those are a lot of fun. I, I love the food squishies. Oh, they have a taco lurking down here. Of course, you got to squish all of them. <laughs> That's a big, meaty taco. So cool. New squishies are always good. They have some Squish Delish, Shopkins, they have a ton, yikes, a ton of cutie cars, the three packs. And then here is a look down the action figure aisle. Not too much going on. This Walmart, for some reason, does not have like a Funko section, um, or at least a separate one. They do have some of the FNAF mystery minis. Those are cool. You have a Ballora, Funtime Foxy. And then Minecraft plushies. These are cute. The blue sheep. Those are cool. Lots of little grocery gang and minions. Ooh, and then this Roblox set. The fashion one. That's awesome. And then the die cast as well as Transformers. So now I'm at Toys R Us and they have so many Num Noms toys as well as the new Num Noms light up plushies, which, oh my goodness, in person, these look adorable. They look like they're going to be extra fluffy or fuzzy. So here are the four you can get. I think this one's the puppy dog. That is awesome. So they come in like a blue, taller, like almost a milkshake type jar. <laughs> with the ice cream frosting on top. They have this one with the orange bow. I think this one's the bunny. And I think they come with a small little um, light up like nom inside that you put inside the plushie. So super cute. That's exciting. <laughs> um, these are $14.99 at Toys R Us. Cool. They also have the new uh, Season 2 Hatchimals. They have a ton of different ones. I love that little cow. Very cute. Ooh, and they have the rose gold one. So these are the Toys R Us exclusive little crates. It's a six-pack of the rose gold characters. Rose gold seems to be a, a thing now. <laughs> 
that's cool. They also have some season one. And then moving on to the Disney Zoom Zooms, we have a Marvel Series 5, as well as Series 8. I know Series 9 is out. There are so many. <laughs> the series come out a little too, too quick to collect there. But that is cool. They even have some advent calendars. And then down here they have the Egg Babies, like surprise plushies. Very cute as well. They're still restocking after Christmas, but they do have some of the new, um, or newer Squish Delish. I think these are the second series. So those are cool. Let me get one out to Squish here. This one's a thin one, though. Oh, that was a, a, bad, <laughs> a bad choice. Oh, they have a slot up top, so you can put it back in. Very cute. And then over here, they actually have some of the Series 3, or maybe not. They have the box. Oh, and an open one. Oh, that's not good. I'll shove it back in there. But they had <laughs> Series 3. They have some of the Series 2 uh, Shopkins ones that are in here. But let's take a look at some of the characters. That whale looks adorable. Oh, they have that shark. I like him. Cool. They also have some of the new soft and slow squishies, as well as series two of the jungle in my pocket. Those are cute. And then Animal Jam. I noticed all their toys are pushed back on the shelves, so they must be doing inventory. I hope, because the last Toys R Us that was arranged like this went out of business, and that was a couple years back. It was sad. It was one of my first toy hunt places, too. So I'm hoping they're just doing inventory. They do have some of the glitter LOL surprise balls, too. And they limit two per person. Cool. And then down the pony aisle, they have some of the Equestria Girl dolls. They are super cute. Rainbow Dash, Rarity... Oopsies, um, Applejack. I like the faces on these dolls. Um, they're definitely better than some of the, the older ones. Rarity especially looks gorgeous. And then to the LPS stuff, they have some of the cute little Frosting Frenzy two packs way up here. <laughs> Those are cute. They also have that little mini set. I don't see any of the longer packs. Those were just really cool. I hope they, they make more. And then they have some of the play sets. They have this little Enchantimals panda play set. She's cute. As well as a lot of these Zuru hamsters. They're very colorful. And then in the Minecraft section, they actually have the Festive Biome Pack. This is the first time I've seen it outside of Fry's when I found it. Um, I love this pack. It is so cool. It's not on clearance or anything. It is full price, $19.99. But you get a reindeer and you get a gingerbread man. It, it's so cool. They did a good job. And then Pokemon. What's this? This is, um, oopsies. This you have... Uh, Frogadier, which is cool. Oops, he goes here. That's a neat one. You got cute Snorlax with his soft belly. Awesome. They have a ton of, of Pokemon stuff, as well as a bunch of um, larger figures and Evolution plushies. They have a whole line of those. There's Lunala. I have not seen the um, large Solgaleo figure. And I'm really wanting to see him if he's going to be as big as Lunala because she's huge. <laughs> but she's awesome. Those two are some of my favorite Sun and Moon characters. Other than Mimikyu because he's adorable. Let's see. Five Nights at Freddy's. They have a lot of plushies. Wow. Have some Funtime Foxies. There's a ton. And then they have some um, older Series 2 collectible Nightmare figures. That's cool if you're still looking for Series 2. And then Roblox, also a ton of Roblox stuff. Huh, they have this mystery figure six-pack. 
I've never seen that before, but it looks like they're just like the individual blocks. So I'm sure it's ones you can get from series one, I think. But you just get all, all six together. Cool. Probably means you won't get duplicates, which that's always nice. I could be wrong. <laughs> And then they have some of these cool Power Rangers figures by Bandai. And then more Pokemon stuff and Ruby. Ooh, they have a new mini figure set. <gasps> and it has Ditto. Oh my goodness. It has cute little Ditto. It has Gumi and Picky Pack. Okay, that's awesome. That is so cool. Um, I loved the first series. Alolan Vulpix is in there. Wow, so many cute characters. Goom Gooms. <laughs> That's adorable. Oh, there's Mimikyu. And then they also have some of the other places. What's the other one? Um, Pikachu. Cool. That big pack is $24.99. Or no, $29.99. Yikes. <laughs> but that's cool. And then here's a look at the Funko Pops. They have a ton, and oh my goodness, that is a chase right there of Cupcake from Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh my goodness, I've never found a chase figure before. <gasps> and it says limited edition. Really? Really? <laughs> that is so cool. Oh my goodness. That looks awesome. There's just so many. I'm going to have to scan through. See, they have the regular cupcake that came out with the Nightmare series. Wow, that is a super sweet find. Oh my goodness, I am so excited about that. And I will open it. <laughs> I know some people like it in the box, but it's just too cool. You, you got to open it. <gasps> That's so cool, and they're going to look so neat displayed together. Like, so awesome. So, he's coming home with me. <laughs> okay, so I am back home from my toy hunt, and the rest of the video will be the haul portion, in case you guys want to stick around and see what I bought. So, first up, Target wowed me yet again with their clearance items. So, I did go back for the Astronomy Cosmic Space Station set from Basher Science. It comes with Alpha Centauri, that cute little figure, and I'm thinking, okay, it's on clearance. I see it now. I might as well get it because I would be so sad if next time I went back and it was gone. So I did pick up that, and then I also picked up, um, I think this is the last set that I wanted to collect, which is the Light Illuminator Experiment Playset. It comes with the awesome light bulb figure, and this is a really cool um, sort of electromagnetic set thing going on. Awesome. And then the Target I went to this time was different than the Target in my last toy hunt. So they actually had a World of Nintendo figure on clearance that I, I needed. It's Link from Breath of the Wild. How cool is that? And he was half price, $4.98, regularly $9.99. So I just thought that was cool. It seems like various Targets have various selections. Some of you have commented on that before too. And some Targets don't do the full 50% markdown just yet. So you definitely have to kind of hunt around and, and see what Target has what. Um, yeah, so I was really happy to find Link because I love me, my Legend of Zelda. And then this Target also had the Little Green Men on clearance for $1.98. I've never opened these, but I figured I might as well try one. Um, there's a girl, I think it's, no, that's not a girl. There's one with like a red ponytail. She looks really cute. I'm, I'm hoping to get her. Um, they also had some of the larger packs on clearance too, but they weren't half off yet. So I kind of have my eye on them just in case. And then in addition to awesome clearance, Target wowed me with the new Num Num Series 5 sets. Um, this is the Jelly Rolls, which they look so cute. Oh my goodness, I really like the the new look on these guys. So there were four total. So I picked up the Jelly Rolls, and then I also picked up the adorable croissants. <laughs> and look at this guy with the bow tie and beret. And this one's just love and life right there. So this was a really cute set. They do have the marshmallow squares and ice creams. Um, I didn't see this one. I did see this one, but it looks very similar to some of the other ones out. So eventually I will pick those up, but it was another very successful toy hunt. And then Walmart had fingerlings and 
I bought the sloth. I just thought he's so cute. I love sloths. They're adorable. And there's just something about this one. The monkeys are cute too, but the sloth, his, his name's Kingsley, slow and steady. So I'm not sure if he's like a Walmart one. I know there's a unicorn. I'm not sure if, if they're just in general, all the stores get those, but definitely love the sloth and I'm excited to open him. Um, electronic pets are really cool. So we'll put him off to the side. And that was my first time I've ever seen the sloth in captivity. So that was really cool. And then I do this every time. Toys R Us is my last stop. And by then I've spent over my budget. So I only bought one thing at Toys R Us. It was very tempting to buy those lights plushies from Num Noms, but I did not. I could not pass up the chase figure of the cupcake from Five Nights at Freddy's. I've never found a chase figure before. It does say limited edition. The box is a little dented, but again, I open these up so I don't mind. And and it just looks super cool. So yay for that. It was just sitting out there in the pile of a ton of Funko Pops. So uh, there you have it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to see more of my daily videos and also check out my toy hunting playlist for my weekly toy hunt. I want to thank you guys so so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye bye!